Hey, uh, what do you recall what your initial thoughts were way back when you were first cast in Boyhood? Um, I know it's going back about years now. Yeah, and it, I mean, kind of just the way you perceive the world is pretty different back then. But yes, I mean, I was just driving. I was excited. I enjoyed acting a lot. You know, I did a lot of theater when I was young, and I had a couple small parts in movies at that point. And sort of knew who Richard Linklater was. I think I had seen Wake in Life. That's probably probably yeah, pretty advanced seen. for six. Yeah, but it's not. You know, it's it's not. I wasn't seeing that when I was six. <laughs> Although my, jaws, my dad take me to, did take me to see Jaws when I was five, which messed me up, but that's... that's right. Um, um, we all, the one thing is we all can be kind of temperament when we're kids, and, um, you know, were there any times when your parents could say, honey, Richard's coming to town again, time to make the movie, were you ever like, oh, mom, I don't want him? <laughs> any of those kind of... Not really. I mean, well, Richard lived in Austin, so I, oh, I, I would see him, you know, several times throughout the year and kind of always be, you know, kind of thinking about the project, but... Um, but no, I mean, I always enjoyed it. It, uh, it was a really fun process, you know, to be a part of, so. How much notice in the did you, did you have before, you know, when you knew when more filming was it, I mean, it was generally around the same time, like kind of end of summer, a time of year, but um, it really depended, you know, sometimes it would, because it was all about, like, figuring out Ethan and Patricia's schedules, you know, and they both work a lot, so. It, it changed, and, and a lot of times would just, you know, be like, you hear like, oh, like, oh we're filming in like a week, you know, right. <laughs> the next month. Did Richard ever talk to you about what's going on in your life, that, you know, at that point in your, in your, as you were growing up, and maybe incorporate that more to your character? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, he was always, I mean, when I was young, you know, he was always kind of just asking me about my life and what was going on and, and that sort of thing and, you know, how I was feeling about things. And, but then, I, you know, as I got older, it became more of a collaboration and, it, you know, had a lot of input into not necessarily like the events of the script but just kind of Mason's you know reaction and his just his personality right um, um Ethan oh, of course Ethan Hawke played your father in the movie and he got into acting pretty young himself um and it, it, was he like a, any kind of father, uh, father figure to you in any way you know maybe guiding you as be a better actor during those years I mean definitely a mentor and Richard and Patricia you know they were just kind of like a <laughs> At acting school, but <laughs> just by doing it, not not going to a class. Um, and, and I mean, even now, you know, with all of just like making the movie was was one thing, but now it's like releasing it has been such a whirlwind. There, it's been good to have them on my side. I was I mean I had Boyhood picked for my Oscar pick. I mean I was I kind of went down my pool a little bit because <laughs> I was like I know no Boyhood Birdman no Boyhood man I was like I was a big Boyhood. Big boyhood um, thing, thing, you know. But uh, what are your thoughts? You know, coming away, it's been a month now. So, um, but what do you, what you know? What are your thoughts? And uh, I mean, I thought it should have gotten more. I mean, what do you uh, after the Oscars have calmed down, all the award season's over, I mean, the movies out, and I mean, honestly, I'm just kind of glad it's done. You know, <laughs> it was such a like I'm glad I did all of that, but it just you know kind of takes over your life for several months there, and it's uh, I, I was certainly you know upset the night, that night, that we didn't, that we didn't win after all that time, but, um, but honestly, I'm just relieved, you know, it's, it's, it's a lot of pressure winning <laughs> and going up on stage and everything, and it kind of takes things to a different level, you know, so. I was, I mean, I was very happy at least Patricia won, I mean, I did have her pick there, too. Yeah, she, she's, she deserved it, and, and we did win at the Baptist. Yes, we did. And uh, was that your first screen, you know, was your first, that kiss on screen, your first kiss kiss? But not to get no. First, okay, okay, good. No, I mean, Richard kind of made sure of that, you know, that he wasn't having me, like, do something, on, pretend to do something on screen mm -hmm. for the first time, you know, or something you know, that I hadn't done in my real life. Um, you know, like drinking the right. beer and smoking the joints, <laughs> that kind of stuff. He does, you know, he, that's too weird. He right. was cautious. Mm -hmm. So, and maybe, maybe we don't get to pick this, but where would you like to see your career go from here? I mean, you know, everyone's talking about you, it's really, you know, everyone just was, I mean, I was impressed with you, everyone impressed with you, so where would you like to, see, you know, see your own career go towards? I mean, I will say, I, re I mean, I really want to go to college, and I, I definitely, I mean, I'm going to keep making movies, I think, and probably other kinds of art. I do, hear, I, think I, I think I read, you know, you do like to draw, I know that, you know, you have an like, artistic and photography, and... I mean, I, I, you know, I'd like to make films, too. So. I, I'm a very big proponent that 
filmmaking is 100% an art form. It is, definitely. Do you write also? You also just Yeah, I mean, I, I do. I, I've never really written, like, that kind of thing, but, you know. <laughs> but you see something like, I, I definitely with, could, I yeah, think. Yeah, like starting with short, like, making, like, writing and directing a short. That would be cool. And going from there. I definitely thought about it. Mm-hmm. Any, I do like writing. Right. Any genres of film that you would like to, like, you know, mm. to explore and be in? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I'm really interested in kind of telling stories more visually and kind of aesthetically than through dialogues and like, like a good example this year was like Under the Skin you know it was very like it was a very clear narrative but it's just kind of all told through visual signals and images and stuff and I think that's really interesting and that's, that's the kind of movie I want to make anyways but you know I'm interested in acting in all kinds of things what do you love most about acting? Um, I mean, I think it's a therapeutic, or it can be a very therapeutic thing, you know, to, especially when you're kind of, when you're collaborating with the filmmaker and kind of helping to create the character, you can take, you know, elements of yourself and explore them through a, a fiction. Okay. Anything? All right, man. Well, thanks a lot. It was a great interview. Yeah. Of course. Congratulations for everything. I appreciate it.